Hey there, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today we're doing some more nails um, on my nails. This is, doo -doo -doo, it's, there it is, <laughs> uh, Dimension Nails, and it's Scarlet Peacock Butterfly. And it is this beautiful red. Um, I was gifted this polish from nailstuff.ca. Um, the last year or the year before, I can't remember. And then on this hand, you'll see many on this one. It was Cadillacer, and this one's Enchanted Woodland. And I shake the crap out of this thing, but I can't get rid of the the whiteness. But it's beautiful. It goes on. But we're doing nails on this hand. Um, we are going to be doing plaid again, cause. This is my Uber Chic, pretty in plaid. I'm going to keep using it until I've used all the plaid. <laughs> so today, we are doing these two. So, I'm going to do... Oops, catching on my cord. So, I'm going to do gold. So, this is Maniology. It's lit. And then, I am using Queen Black. Blackjack. So, so I want to do kind of um, so the thin lines is going to be in um, trying to one sec. Okay, so the thin lines going to be in gold, and the dark lines going to be in the black. So I'm just going to undo both. So I don't know, it says left side, all layerable, look for arrow. So I'm kind of thinking I do want to put the gold on top of the black. I think that'll look better. So let's try it. So hold the plate down. Light pickup. Oh, I got rid of some of it. So, when in doubt, if you can't get it, grab a piece of tape. So let's let's do the baby. Should have done it a little higher, but <laughs> that's okay. Oh, I forgot to put acetone on my cotton ball. I have to clean off because I got some of the black in that line. So let's try the gold. And I didn't scrape properly. And I don't know if I can get all that out. There. Most of it's gone on my nails because um, my nails are so small. So I'm just going to take this tape and then go around. But that doesn't look too bad. Okay. Let's try this again. Let's try it on the thumb first and then, because then it's got more. So 
pull the plate down, scrape, pick up, and of course I didn't pick it up properly. Hopefully that corner doesn't matter too much. No, actually that worked out well. So there. So that worked. Okay. Get rid of that. And now in with the gold. I don't know if I scraped too hard. I think I did. Ah, not too bad. I thought I scraped too hard where I got all the polish out. So, oh, that looks nice. I like that. Doesn't that look good? And then I can just go in. with the tape and get off. I don't have to do this right away. I mean, I'm going to go in. I'm just kind of wanting to show you what it looks like. I know I'm wasting time. But yeah, that looks good. Okay. I'm happy girl. So let's do this again. So, so far I've used this one, this one, and this one. I'm going to sit down and I'm going to paint a bunch of nails, I think. And see, oops. See if we can try and do a swatch video. want to get that top line off. Okay. So I just kind of pat down all the edges. I don't care if it's gone on my skin because I'm using the, the tape. So the tape actually helps. So we can go in with the gold. I'm just going to go in and get rid of what I don't want. And then, oops. I just went in and redid to move the line up higher just because I wanted some of the gold. So we move both. So, so black. Scrape. got in the bottom but that's okay my nails short so I won't my lint ruler is down to like the very last um, oh, pat that down um, so it's down to the last thing so it's not totally to the edge so it's kind of harder to pick up. So. so gold, pull the plate down, scrape, 
roll and pick up. So get what I don't want off. And then aim where I want and touch down. There. There we go. One more nail. I can flip this over and then clean. Okay, and black. the plate down because you can see as I move it it moves the plate so that's why you want to hold them down so it's a little steadier especially when you're doing lines and I don't I I didn't push or roll them the stamp properly so that's why I'm missing some of it but it's okay because it's um, I, it's not, my nail's not big enough for it. So you have to, when you're rolling, have full um, pressure on the, the, the stamp. Like, don't tilt it. And that's what I'm doing. I'm not, I'm just kind of, whoop, all right, I'm being too hurried. So I'm not letting the stamper touch the plate evenly. So you want it to touch evenly, and then that way it'll pick up everything, not just part of the stamp. Oop, it's like, pick the right line. Okay, so aim, and then down. Okay, so clean off that. Just move that aside for the moment. So, um, so my Facebook group, um, the second I'm I'm behind in my days, but I'm I'll get there. <laughs> um, the theme for the second day is snowman. So I was thinking of adding a little snowman to like one of my nails. See, and then doing the tape trick, it really gets rid of a majority. And then sometimes if it's on your nail or on your skin or whatever, I use my thumbnail to kind of go in and push just to or I kind of rub just to kind of clean up on the edge. Say so rub and then it'll get rid of it. So, and doing the tape thing really, really helps. Um, it minimizes my, my contact with um, acetone because then after I just go in slightly with my little cuticle brush and I don't have much cleanup to do at all so it makes it faster so okay uh, let me finish cleaning up one second okay so I am going to use uh, uber chic jingle of the way and I'm gonna do this little snowman so I am going to pick them up in white because I want the snowflakes to be white and then I'll just color them in so hold the plate down scrape and roll and pick up and then I can get rid of what I don't want. Flip that off and then put that aside. So he picked up well. So now 
Okay, so I just grabbed all the polishes I need. I'm going to do black for his hat, white for his body, orange for his nose, and blue for his scarf. So I'm just trying to get... So I'm just going to put a little bit of polish on for his hat. So I turn that over and take a look. I haven't gone to all to the edges. So that's good. Oh. I need some acetone. Okay, so now I'm going to go in with a little orange for his nose. I should have picked a bigger little snowman. He's awfully small. <laughs> We're going to say thinner outlines. The outlines are awfully big. So we're going to do blue scarf. Just trying to get my brush to go back pointy. doesn't want to go pointy for some reason. I think that's part of the reason, too. That's a horrible-looking snowman. It's really hard to see. I don't like him. Maybe I should have made him black. Hmm. Let's try another snowman. Okay, hang on. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of this snowman because he's... I don't know if you can see him, but he's so hard to see his features. He doesn't look very good. <laughs> so, I'm going to use this snowman, but I'm going to take away all the the stars around it. I'm just going to use the snowman. He didn't pick up very well. Hang on. Okay, so I ended up using my hit the bottle stamper. So it worked way better. So I think this one's stickier. So, okay. One sec. Okay, so I'm going to go in with tape and get rid of all the parts I don't want. So, you can totally do that. Like, if there's parts that you don't want, you can always take them off. Just be careful. Because I've done it where I've... I've accidentally taken off parts that I like. And it's like, ah. Uh. Okay. So, he looks good.
One moment. Okay, so while I was trying to wait for my little snowman to dry, I've put top coat on all the nails except for my middle one. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I probably don't need a sticky base coat because he's probably still wet enough. But um, I'll just put it on just to be on the safe side. And I'll probably wait about 20 seconds or so, 20, 30. And um, then we'll come back and put them on one sec. Okay, so I should be good. Oh, here. Okay, so kind of aim them where I want. Touch down, slight side, and then side to side. So he just fit. Probably could have done it on my ring finger. He's a little bit bigger, but that's okay. Okay, so now I am going to get my SC speed setter and I'm going to put. Up coat him in. Okay, and there we go. I think it turned out cute. I really like this plant. So, when I was thinking afterwards, I could have used this would look good with the red, but then use like a sheer. I have a Chi Modern uh, sheer black, so the black would be a little lighter. And then, um, and then the gold, I think that would look pretty as well. But, um, yeah, that's very cute. So thanks for hanging out with me while I do, um, my snowman nails and using some more plaid because we're into plaids right now. Okay. Uh, so stay tuned for swatch photos. And then of course, as per always puppies and, uh, yeah, love you guys. And remember, be someone sparkle. Mm-hmm. <laughs>